Okay, this is a little video describing the project I would like to try. Uh, what you're seeing here is a website that we built using some technology from Autodesk called Autodesk Forge. Um, this is based off of a GitHub project that's out in the marketplace under Forge RCDB.NodeJS. Uh, this project was written by the people at Autodesk to kind of give you an exa example of how you could use their technology. So what this does is essentially we upload our model to the cloud. It turns it into a 3D viewable model. Then the Autodesk Forge platform allows you to like, you know, use their technology to view and zoom around this model. You can um, cut sections through the model um, using this technology. Um, so if I want to just see this section of the, of the building, um, if I want to slice it maybe in other directions, I can do that. So it allows you to sort of um, cut and, and dice the model up any way you want to. You can explode the model. But this is all the base technology given to you by Autodesk right out of the, out of the, the box. The thing I'm interested in for this project is this idea of connecting database information with the model. So if I have some information in a database, this is a MongoDB database, um, all the pieces of aluminum in this building that have an aluminum property then get set, uh, sorted out and it gives me you know, a price for that material. So let's say you know, this is my price per kilogram, this is the aluminum, and so it gives me the total amount of aluminum in the model and then a dollar figure. Um, if I click on one of these, it actually filters the model for the things that have these properties. And this is what I'm interested in. So um, this example that came from the GitHub example um, is great for materials. But what I want to be able to do is take the same model that I built, and I want to be able to filter based on what we've installed on the job site or what we've built in our shop. So I have a database, um, a SQL Server database inside the company that contains the information about where we are on the project. So each of these pieces of glass, let's say, on this model have an index number in them. And I have a database that tells you whether that index number is installed or not. So I want to be able to have a button over here that I click on that would then filter this model for all to show you and highlight in, let's say, orange or something, all the items in the model that have been installed. Um, I also have the information on whether it's been fabricated or whether it's been done in engineering. So if somebody opens this model, they could have these three buttons, one for uh, fabrication, one for engineering, and one for installation, that when they click on them, the model would automatically highlight in some color which of the elements are done. So that's what I want to be able to do. We have the data, um, we have the Forge platform and the model. I just need to be able to connect the two. Um, and this GitHub project gives you a good idea of how it would be done, but I just don't have the ability or capacity right now to code that out. So I'm just hoping maybe you can help me with that project. And in doing that, we could sort of understand a little bit better how we could work together. And that's the goal of this project. So thank you very much.